Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. We're going to do another spooky reaction video today. Hopefully it's a good one. They normally are. This one's from Spookify's channel. I'm so grateful for them giving us permission to use the videos. If you wouldn't mind popping by their channel and dropping them a sub, we very much appreciate this. The link is in the description. Uh, please sub to my channel if you haven't already done so. Hit the thumbs up and leave your feedback in the comments. Or if you want to discuss this or any of my other videos, come by my live streams from around 10 o'clock UK PM. And went and have a chat. Right, let's get straight into this one. This one's called Scary Ghost Videos Volume 5. Uh, Spookify stuff's normally pretty creepy, so hopefully it's a good one. Let's get the cans on and check it out, shall we? A man named Latham has recently yes. documented his paranormal... This guy's a bit of an idiot. It, 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 it's got to be fake, all this. It seems to be ongoing and ongoing. He went on holiday and it followed him to Portugal or wherever. Uh, there's a lot of TikTok videos and he's he's trying to get people to prove how he's doing it. But it's it's all a bit silly. ...experiences on his TikTok page. If it was real, fair play. But it, the way he comes across and stuff, it just... I don't know. There's something not right. He claims to be living in a haunted apartment, and according to Leighton, the paranormal activity mostly happens late at night. One evening before heading over to a friend, he captures this on camera. What's that white thing, guys? Can you see it? Whoa, hello. It's about 8 o'clock, guys. I'm going. Did you see that white thing about here? I'm going to have to watch the footage back. It's about 8 pm. I'm going out at 9 p.m. I'm staying at friends. I've just come round to. I'm just trying to get a bit of footage before we go. The chairs are still on the table. Holy water in here. Just experimenting, guys, at the minute. I'm trying to learn as much as I can before, you know, before I go holiday next week. The curtains in front of him seemingly close all by themselves. Leighton has a water gun ready with holy water, which he fires towards the curtains. As we'll see, it might not have caught the spirit. Because obviously it follows me, there's no point keep running. Also, it's better to learn as much as possible kind of thing, so I'll be doing that. But yeah, did you see that white thing, guys? Whoa, guys, I'm, I'm actually going a bit earlier. That's a new fucking one. That is a new one. I'm just going up cl close, guys. This is why I'm doing it raw footage on my phone, so I can actually walk over to things. If I do things from a corner, from a camera in the corner of the room, you can't come over and investigate. So it's more authentic like this. This is why the videos are getting a lot of attention. There's no um, fishing line, guys. They didn't put the main light on properly. After a while, a lamp can be seen shaken back and forth with no reasonable explanation. In the video, Leighton also demonstrates that there is no trickery involved, as he shows a close-up on the lamp afterwards. The following night, Leighton is once again tormented by paranormal activity. I put my mirror up. Stuff like that, fair enough. But it's just getting silly now, where people are saying, oh, you're using green screen suits and stuff. And he's like, put like hundreds of balloons all around different colours and stuff so we kind of key them all out and what have you but it's it's just getting a bit silly now okay it's the door guys because i was just chilling watching tv in here i was gonna try and have a nap because i've been fucking tired door closed and then i've been hearing scratching so someone advised if you hear any scratching or anything again put me near the door this is about 20 minutes ago so you know, maybe it worked, maybe it didn't, God knows, but obviously guys, I think there might be something about this room it doesn't like because no activity happens in this room, just scratching at the door, sometimes it closes or opens. It's not the Buddha, a few people have said it might be the mirror, which I don't know, but it doesn't like coming in this room for whatever reason, so if anyone's got any suggestions or anything like that, I'm sure just heard a bit of scratching again then. But yeah guys, it don't come in here, maybe anyone's... You know, got some suggestions or something like that. Fuck me, what the f guys? That was a weird one. Whoa. Leighton has brought with him his mirror into the bedroom as he is convinced that the paranormal activity might be caused by this object. A little into the video, the door is seemingly pushed open by an unseen force. Later the same night, he once again experiences paranormal activity 
and this time, he makes sure to walk around all the rooms to prove that nobody is in there with him. These must have been some of the earlier ones when it did seem a bit more believable, to be honest. Um, but yeah, we'll keep an eye on it and see what's happening. But it, it, it just seems to be asking, like I said, he went to Portugal and apparently had followed him over there and moved money on the table and things like that. Five thirty AM guys, door's been banging. It's not knock on the door. So I'm tripping the card in it. All these doors are closed. I should have closed that bathroom door because someone's gonna say somebody was hiding there. So I've checked both sides there. I'm using the bathroom. Nobody wants to go in there. That's all luck, guys. I woke up to scratching and light knocks on my door. And... So, is Leighton's apartment really haunted by what seems to be a poltergeist? You tell me. Yeah, that was not what you think. But like I said, if you watch some more of his more recent stuff on TikTok, it's just getting silly now. Like, but um, it was quite believable at the beginning. The following video was captured on January thirty first this year. The footage is taken from a home surveillance camera located outside the house. In the footage, a ghostly figure can be seen walking down the street. Have a look. A ghost-like figure appears as if walking down the street. The figure comes off as transparent but yet visible. As it walks down, it seems to fade away before just disappearing out of view. Is this a ghost caught on camera? You decide. A lot of people might see a digital glitch or whatever, but um, I do like these ones. They do seem a bit more authentic. Let us know what you think. Our next scary video was uploaded to TikTok account Mandy ASMR22. She tells the story of something disturbing their home. It all started one night when their home surveillance camera got something really disturbing on camera. Who are you? Need someone out of horror for them. figure can be seen outside the second story window trying to get in. The figure comes off as humanoid, but it's hard to tell if this is a human or something else. In the following days, Mandy's cameras captured several disturbing events. In the corner of the footage, close to the shed, a dark figure appears. The figure can be seen standing there for some seconds before it just walks out of view. A couple of days later, when Mandy was out of the house for the weekend, her CCTV camera captured this scary event. To 
this day, Mandy has no idea who or what this creature could be. That's terrifying. It's even more terrifying if it is just some person. That, that's worrying, that mind. The following scare video has been yeah, circulating the internet one. the last few days. A man is live streaming himself out running on an almost daily basis. This time, when he was out in the forest, something could be seen chasing him in the background. Mais je pense que le professeur ne, ne va pas venir aujourd'hui. Donc je retourne à la maison. Halfway through the video, a pale figure can be seen running out behind him from a bush. The man starts running for his life, while the figure continues to chase. Many of the commenters believe this to be a cannibal, but take a look at the eyes of the creature. Do they really look human? Others believe it to be an alien, or even a skinwalker. But what do you think of this one? That is horrifying, like, what do you guys think? Our next scary video was captured on a CCTV camera at an unknown location. The CCTV footage has captured something that is truly bizarre. Have a look. What the fuck is that? That dog's barking at That's mad. Looks like someone with a trolley there. A strange figure can be seen drifting down the side of the road. And a pack of dogs have taken notice of the figure and run up to it, seemingly a little frightened. Eventually, the figure slowly moves its way across the road. Viewers are left clueless of what this could have been. Some speculate the figure to be of a ghost, haunting the side of the road. Perhaps this spirit once died in a car crash and is now roaming the roads for eternity, struggling to move on. This next scary widow was uploaded to Reddit. The footage is taken from an outdoor home surveillance camera at the front door of a house. One evening, when the house owner returned home after grabbing a couple of beers, something strange was caught on camera. As the man is unlocking the front door, a bizarre looking string can be seen floating towards him. The figure almost resembles as if a snake has launched at him. But the man does not notice the strange figure that seems to hit him in the back. The man explains that he randomly took notice of the figure when checking the footage, as there was no unusual alert from the home surveillance. So is this something supernatural caught on camera? That's mad. The following video has little to no context but seems to feature some strange figure in the background. Watch. Voldemort. As the woman pans the camera around, a dark yet blurry figure with a pale face can be seen in the background. It's hard to tell if this is even anything paranormal, but the woman in the footage seems unaware of the figure. So what is this? Strange. UFO. I do like UFO stories. Our as well. next creepy video was posted to Reddit. A man claims to have captured a potential UFO on camera late one night. He noticed some strange lights in the sky and decided to record it with his phone. This is what he captured. At 
first three red blinking lights are seen floating high above before they suddenly fade away. And as they do, four new lights appear a little to the left. That's mad. So is this something extraterrestrial it looks like it sort of camera? Fears an outing where you pay and be further down. Be sure to check out this video or if That's crazy. And some good stuff in there again. Like I said, I do enjoy Spookify stuff. Um if you wouldn't mind subbing to his channel, I'd be grateful for that. And again, I am appreciative of the support of him letting us use the videos. And let us know what you guys think in the comments or if you want to discuss this or any of the other videos come by my live stream and we'll have a chat. Sub to the channel if you haven't already done so and hit the thumbs up as well that'd be very much appreciated. And yeah I'll catch you in the next one hopefully with some more good spooky stuff. See you then.